Oil prices fell to less than $62 a barrel on Monday as investors continued to worry about a global economic slowdown. U.S. light crude hit a 17-month low, and London's Brent crude fell below $60 a barrel. Prices continued their slide despite a pledge by members of OPEC to cut production by more than 5 percent, or 1.5 million barrels a day. OPEC President Shakib Hillel says the group will consider further production cuts by the end of the year if demand does not pick up. Halil said at an emergency OPEC meeting on Friday, there is an oversupply of oil. If your buyers are not going to be able to get letter of credits from your, the banks, they're not going to be able to, to even buy the crude. Oil prices have fallen by more than half since hitting a record high of more than $147 a barrel in July. Analysts say investors fear a global economic recession will further slash demand for energy. Anthony Grisanti is president of GRZ Energy in New York. So really it's all about demand at this point. Um, and without any demand, I can see oil washing out back down to the $50 level where we started this from uh, two years ago. In another sign that the global financial crisis is spreading to oil-rich states, Kuwait suspended trading in one of the country's largest financial institutions, Gulf Bank, on Sunday. The bank has been hit with losses from risky financial instruments called derivatives. Leita Hongfincher, VOA News.